almost no one did. Did you like it, uh, I'm a tan? Just curious. No, no judgment if he did. Have you seen Kitty? There are so many books. There are many books in here. Indeed, my darling. I see them all around. So we need to do the second quest for the wizard so that um, I can, he can do something. What, what was the wizard going to do for us? They were going to turn our body back to normal. That's what it was. Hell no. Did you like the original Amnesia? I'm a 10. Can you tell me the right combination for the lock? No, miss, I can't. I haven't learned that at school yet. What are you reading? What is this special book you're reading about? It's about two bunnies making dinner and three of their friends came over. So then there were five bunnies eating dinner. They ate, they eat carrots, you see. Okay. All white rabbits, they will eat dinner. It looks like they are having fun. I hope they are. Two rabbits, then three rabbits, then five. They will eat dinner. Is this a clue to the combination? What a beautiful book. Hello, sorry to bother you. Yes, dear, what's wrong? Um, symbols on lock. Symbols are our numeric system, you know, one, two, three. Oh, I see, thank you, I'll try again. The only good game in the series. I enjoyed Penumbra more than Amnesia. That's an interesting take. I didn't dislike Penumbra, but I didn't like it as, as much as Amnesia. Okay, so here is the, the number sequence. And then I'm assuming this is... This is actually just telling me... Um, this is 20? This is 20. Where's 10? Is this 10? That's 10. So it's just uh, 10 is one dot, 20 is two dots, 30 is three dots, and then uh, line is 40 dots. One, two is one dot, three is two dots. Yeah, I'm just gonna like take a screenshot of this actually. That's for me. That's so that I don't have to keep looking it up, if you don't mind. I've got it open on my second monitor now. Okay. So, so this is one. There are two dots. There are two ones. What is that number? So this would be two dots. So this is 30, I think. No, this is 20, 21. So this is 21 over here. Um, there's more blocks than there are spaces. So we, we're not supposed to like put these in order or something. We have five slots, five empty slots. Why are we a tree? Uh, because we're we, we found our way into uh, Wonderland basically One one two three four All right, I'm wondering if uh, if the the rabbits is a clue. Let's talk to the last person here Hello, sir. What are you doing? I'm looking for my special book. Why are you on a ladder? Because the ladder was made to be used, of course. What if I need it? Then you should wait your turn. What if it's an emergency? And I can't wait that much. Then you should have arrived earlier than me. Sorry, but I have to keep looking. I mean, that's fair. Does this place change depending on the season? Apparently it does. So many books. Well, okay, they're gone now, so we can check out the ladder. I won't climb again. I could break my neck if I fall. 
I don't understand. Why did we move that? Right, and now they're here and the, the tree is back to normal, or the, the ladder is back to normal. I have to open the lock first. I see so many books. I don't think the Great Wizard's book is on the shelves. Is it 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13, 21? Hmm, that's an interesting idea. Because, like, 1, 1 is 2. Uh, this would be 2. Then you think it's, like, 1, 2, and then that's 3? And then 2, 3 is 5. So that would be E. And then, um, 3, 5 is 8. 2, 3, uh, wait, 1... Two, three, so eight is this one. And then five and eight is thirteen. So that would be um ten ten and three. So this is ten and three, I think. Oh, I did it. Oh wow, I'm so great. I have to turn the lever now. I don't know how you figured that one out, Neville, but good job. Still no clue how to spend that day. Birthday day? That must be the wizard's book. <laughs> Spooky! Spooky, scary skeleton. Leave shiver down my spine. Excuse me, sir, I need the book, hee hee. I got some mandragorns. Um... One, two, three, four, five. It's just like random stuff. I don't think I'm necessarily... Okay, we got pregnant skeletons. That's not something I thought I was going to see today. Hope you have a good birthday and are able to figure out what to do, I. Same. I, uh, is there... What, what, what day is your birthday? We could do, we could do something. Have you seen Kitty? There's so... Oh, I already read it. Yes. Okay, let's uh, leave. It's a very common sequence in math and by extension software engineering. I hope I did not make you skip content. Mm, I don't think so. I think I was supposed to figure that out. You definitely accelerated the process, uh, but that's fine. called the Fibonacci sequence. Oh. I thought the Fibonacci spe sequence was a spiral. The ninth. Uh, that would be... Sunday. Um, we could do an extra thing this Thursday. I'm doing uh, Subnautica and, um, I always forget the name, um, Pathologic 2, but we could, I could do an extra game if you, if you have something you'd like, uh, you'd like me to throw on stream. Here's your book, it was inside the musical box, I saw the doll. I thought Fibonacci was pasta. The Itward Lock. That sounds like fun. Thank you for the book. This certainly makes me remember many things. Many, many things. And now what? There are two things left on the star. Yes, fish in the water. Fish, fish, swimming free. Go back, little fish. Go back home. I'm out of coffee. Well, wow, sir, you woke up the fish. Yes, because I remembered how to do it. Isn't it beautiful? That's magical, sir. Can you do that with other beings like humans? Of course, but only if the circumstances are positive. 
the circumstances are often not positive. I see, sir. Hmm, so I need to find the missing stones, yes? A fish told me that my shoes are on the feet of the amazing dancer. Do you know where this dancer could be? I have no idea. I think I know. I'll go and see. Isn't that uh, at the club? Noise, but I'm content with these games. Really interested in seeing you play both of them. Okay, well, I mean, offers on the table. I was gonna offer an extra stream on Sunday, but I, I don't know if that would necessarily be good. Hello again, did you find your special ticket yet? The show is about to begin. So I have to find a ticket. Does this guy have a ticket? Would you like to join me in the waiting? I have to go home. You're at, you're at home, my friend. The universe is your home. Oh, that's a very nice thought. Uh, what is that smell? Whoopsie, my farts. So the darkness won't haunt me, you know? It's weird, though. I see no darkness. What? What did we just read? What was that? Who has the ticket for the club? I'd like to borrow that boat. The cat is really cute. I like the cat. That was a rock. Can he fix this? I'll just leave it there. Okay. Didn't every citizen get one? That must be the castle. Um, do I have to be a citizen to get one? Is that what we're saying? I don't know what this says. Hello. Who is there? Who? Can't, can't you see me? Oh, now I see a little. You have four eyes. Wow. What are you selling? Only the very best plobas. Oh yeah, this, this guy sells poo. This, they look like coconuts. It's poo, miss. Poo that I collect, they are not coconuts. Like in the toilet? Wow, I thought it was really bad to eat poo. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's... I had to read that uh, twice now. You can sneak into the bar where the bug will not let you go. Okay. Oh, there's more over here. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, there's a hole behind the firewood. Splendid. Come on, kitty, we'll go inside and remember I need a ticket to get in, too. Maybe you can take somebody else's. I don't want to steal. Well, just borrow it, kitty. We can give it back later, all right? All right. Mimple had to read about poo twice now. He sure did. That's amazing. A self-playing piano. That's a face on the wall. I 
I think those are the shoes, maybe? That's scary. Giant fleas? No, thank you. That's the dancer. A moth. I used to eat those, but I won't this time. This ladybug is the tiniest I've seen around, besides the fly. Can I borrow your ticket, please? Because my ticket disappeared. Oh, I can't. I'm using it as a coaster. This lemonade is very good. Why, you have a table to put the glass on. I don't like the sound of glass against the table. And you like this lemonade very much, right? Yes. I, I drink it because it's refreshing. If you excuse me, I want to listen to the music. Of course, goodbye. Um, I feel like I'm supposed to prevent the dude from making lemonade. Have we found... A <laughs> I don't think so. And once for farts for of a prey mantis. Sneak in when gra Grasshopper delivers lemons. This dude is dancing a dance. That dancer's moves are from another world. Oh, they, they're asleep, so we can take the ticket now. Oh, this place doesn't exist anymore. I have the ticket, I have it. You're incredible, kitty. I love you so much. Now we can get inside. All right. seems that a ticket found a way to get into my hands. Let me see. This can't be right. It just can't. I already let someone in with that ticket. You bring many mysteries, little lady. But how can you know it was somebody else's ticket? The symbols are correct, but look at the handwriting. This belongs to someone much older than you. I can see it. Alright then, is there any chance I can get inside? I mean, is it possible? When you have your own ticket, little lady, you are more than welcome. Man, really? This ticket looks like the exterminator uh, card I found in Antonio's house. Oh. Can we, like, combine them? Can we give this to them? Text on it gives us, can give us trouble. Crayon? Oh, yeah, you're, you're not wrong. It's not really mine. What if we combine that with this? There we go. <laughs> Look, sir, I think this is my own ticket. Hmm, I see, but you simply drew it yourself. I thought it was the right thing to do. I wasn't invited, so I invited myself. Very clever little lady. Well, I guess I can let you go in. Enjoy the show. I need your shoes. Why won't you answer me, please? He's concentrating, I think. Arg. Yeah, my thoughts exactly, honestly. So I, I can't, I don't know if I can get in. Okay, here we go, now we can talk to him. Hello dancer, mister, I really need to take your shoes. And why is this? The shoes belong to the dancer. I'm a dancer, and I need them to uh, dance with the wizard. Oh, I'm sorry, what did you say? What did you just say, I want your shoes. <laughs> you want what, a little lemonade? You seem to be a little tense. I don't want lemonade. Where did you get your shoes from? You should drink a little lemonade, at least to drown your thirst. A great wizard needs them. Oh, but that's impossible. I can't give you my shoes. The only way to get my shoes is to take them from me. And as you can see now, I'm standing on them, so it's impossible. Lift your feet. I could take them. 
can't be done. Only the very day when both of my feet are up in the air. Only then can my shoes be taken. Otherwise, I will stand forever. I see. Well, thank you. Bye. So I'm assuming I have to do something here. Um, I feel like I need a lemonade. I wish I could go backwards instead of uh, only forwards. 95% probability of knife. You're not wrong. I'm thinking I should steal the lemonade and then like pour it on the ground. Or yeah, just yeah, just knife. I don't want to hurt anyone. Well, you could have fooled me. Things not working makes me angry. It makes me feel knifey. Can I get a lemonade? Very much, but I need the shoes of the dancer and I don't know how to get them. Haha, so you like to dance? He is a very good dancer. I've never seen him fall. So he is like the very best dancer of the world. The world? I would say the universe. He always follows the rhythm. Thank you. I have to go by. Can I have a lemonade though? Can you take him while he sleeps? Does the mantis have a house? Can you take them when he sleeps? Um, Is this the same mantis that gets the lemonade? The lemons? I feel like it's this guy. I won't bother them now. Are you having a great time? Have you seen my ticket? I think I, I have to go. I have to do something to trick the dancer. I heard a creature here talking about layered realities, time and such. Rhythm and seasons are important in this land. Everything is connected. So I have to think that all time and space matters and rhythm, of course. Hmm. I can wait until they stop playing. I think I have to mess with the uh, instrument. The self-playing piano has a door down there, I'm curious. Hello? Hello, would you like an autograph? What's the trumpeteer doing? He's fixing the piano, the rhythm must be perfect so we can start the show. I see, thank you. As a door down there. Uh, um. Okay, so what we need to do is the only time we can mess with the piano is when it's uh, springtime, and we need the cat to do that now. Kitty is tired of being illegal. <laughs> but I can't get in. Here's your ticket, miss. I'm sorry, but I took it and I wanted to give it back. Goodness, you are very nice. Thank you very much. The kind thief. I got an achievement for that, but I'm now no closer to solving anything. Knife time! This won't work, huh? Are you? I don't think you're applying the knife correctly. Hmm. Looks like a tropical party place. Hope they open it soon. Does the mantis have a house? Oh, I feel like I have to mess with the... Maybe the cat will help now. 
Kitty is tired of being... Kitty can eat a not good thing. Kitty is making me mad. Did I already solve the puzzle with this? You didn't solve that puzzle yet. Okay, so this is this is it. Can't really do anything here. At least, I don't think so. 95% of these puzzles can be solved with knife. Violence isn't an answer, it is a question. An answer is yes. How are you? No Mr. Antonio? Of course, he was a huge trumpeteer a few years ago. My mother loved his music. I saw him. In the human world, he is very old now. Wow, the human world, well, you know. When we grow old, we all go to the visit other realities to see if we've missed something. Humans don't do that. It's quite fun. I love to get letters from my mother. She tells me many things. Yes, it does sound fun. Well, I have to keep going. Have a nice day. Looks like she's imagining things. Maybe she's expecting someone, or maybe not. I need the shoes of the dancer, and I don't know how to do it. Uh, I was gone for a bit. What did I miss? What are you stuck in? Uh, I have to mess with the piano, but I don't know how. We are trying to stab people again. If I could get, like... I don't know, I'm just like, lost on this one. I tried to get the cat to come in here so we could mess with the piano before, you know, things start, but that doesn't really work. We did try to stab him. Did you talk to the barkeep yet? I did talk to the barkeep. He's a good dancer, I've never seen him fall. Best dancer, he always follows the rhythm. So like, we need to mess with the piano to change the rhythm, but I don't know how to do that. And I can't get in here when it's like springtime or fall. And for some reason the cat won't go inside. Uh, so any any thoughts? I'm I'm like really stuck on this one. Maybe the item from the robot helps. Well, I mean, I have no idea what this 
is going to do for us. I'm not even sure, like, what I'm trying to do here. Apply knife. It has four arms. Worst case scenario, brute force. I, I'm, I'm trying to brute force pretty, pretty hard right now. I have to do something to trick the dancer. I heard a creature here talking about layered realities. Rhythm and seasons are important in this land. Everything is connected. I have to think of that all time and space matters, and rhythm, of course. So yeah, they mentioned the door, and I can't really do much with the door. Maybe I have to find these fleas um, when it's not in season. We have to find these fleas somewhere else so they don't uh, play in rhythm, and then we have to replace them. That's the best I've got so far. I don't know where they would be. Where do you think the fleas would be? You have to make them make home fall somehow. I don't really remember. Okay, no worries. Do we know where the fleas are when they're not there? U.S. Marine Tactics, eat crayon. Can you poison the lemonade at the dude's house? That's a dark thought. Hello, Zelma. Repeat your song. One and one are two, one and two are three. Two and three are five, and three or five are eight. So, okay, there's the answer for the library. There goes Fran the tourist, have fun. Say hello to your world for me when you get there. Well, I will. What are you doing? Good day. I'm pruder. I'm molding this piece of iron. For what? Deliver a few clock pieces to the clockmaker. Um, I have to go. I'm wondering if maybe the clockmaker has something for us. Mr. Cogwind. I'm in a hurry. Can we talk later? Hmm. He just seems to disappear, huh? Let's go to the bar. See if the show has begun. So, I'm assuming that the cat kind of lets you know where you're supposed to be. This is the bartender. Didn't mean to do that, sorry. Looking forward to seeing you at the bar in fall. Okay. Um, 
it's time to uh, employ Bimple's special tactics. Okay. Are you, are you guys ready for Bimple's special tactics? We, we we're just going to use everything on the piano. Uh, maybe we can use it on the coin on flea? No. How's a door down there? Skip to the season where no one is there. The thing is, is I can't because when I go to winter, it kicks me out. The only season that I can, you know, is spring. That, but uh, for some reason, the cat won't go in. Then you can get in the stage. Eh, that was that was my thinking exactly. So the only time, like, I can't go backwards seasons, right? It won't let me go backwards in time. Only forwards. What if you place a crayon on the path that Barkeep takes his, slips his, no lemonade, what? still think the robot is the answer but but like I don't. um I, guys i'm going to look it up sorry but this is holding things up a bit Okay, kind thief. Change the season to spring, then click on the wood lying on the earth. Change the season to autumn. Click on the hole to send Mr. Midnight inside. Wait for the bee to pass out, then pick up your purple ticket. Uh, then combine your green crayon. There we go. Talk to the grasshopper on the left, then change the season to summer and talk to the dancer. If you click on the controller fast enough, you can skip a season. So double click on the controller to skip the, to the spring. Oh. All right. Didn't realize this. So I have to go double click. Aha, there it is. Okay. Oh, I see. I have to make it orange. Well, that's purple. It's just a label. I don't think I'd ever gotten that one. Bad Kitty, why won't you just break the piano, right? The problem is, is that the uh, the dude fixes it, right? This is in springtime before they arrive, and indeed this is fixed. So hold on a second. Press the red and yellow buttons to make the metrotome really fast and 
back out and change the season back to autumn. Oh, I see. You have to double click it fast so that they don't have a chance to fix it. That's a really bizarre solution. All right, well, we solved it. Quotation marks here. Uh, that's the first puzzle in this game that I thought is kind of uh, a little bit obtuse, but it's fine. Whatever. <laughs> Bumpkin Avatar is getting angry. Bumpkin Avatar has had enough. I got the shoes. They are pretty, very pretty. Look. It's throbbing. You did it. You really have an extraordinary machine inside your head. Thank you, sir. Now let's do the last one so I can go home. Last one. I recognize this feather. It belongs to Palantras. I saw him very injured. He will be fine. He has the pink water. That can fix everything. That's true. Well, what do we have? What do we do with the feather? Go visit the old Velakas mechanical doll. There you go. My wand will be there. I have to finish my rabbit science. I think I have the answer. Okay, sir, I'll bring your wand back. Here we go. Now now we get to fool around with the Velakas robot doll. There you go. Easy peasy. If only all the answers could have been that easy. Bumpkin on the right down blinked. Do you think it did? Here's your wizard, sir. Uh, here's, here's your wizard, sir, wand. Magnificent, splendid, you did it. Where are the shoes? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. The stones are very, very special. What I can do is place the stones on the lock of the door. But you, you are the only one who can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me he would show me where the door is. Then we should go and talk with him, don't you think? Wait, I suspect that you can't return home looking like a tree. I almost forgot. Yes, you're right. Can you bring my human body back? Yes, I can. This is exciting. I haven't done this in hundreds of years. Let's make a human, yes? Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. I need to smell it. My clothing? Let me smell this. <laughs> Why did they even let you play with the puppet before it did anything? That's just a recipe for frustration. Right? We'll make a human. This is so exciting. I am so excited right now. Good, now go to the center of the star, Ethersta. Ethersta? Think about your body, your head, your leg, your other leg, your arm, both of them. Now concentrate. A shubili boo, a doobili boo, a shibili bee. Randomly selected elements. Find your path through true, true essence. Become Fran the human now. Ooh, that's not okay. Huh. Are you alright? What happened? Is it done? Oh wow, thank you so much. Do you guys think if I think of, uh, of my human head, I will no longer have a pumpkin? Do you think the, the pumpkin, uh, the bumpkin curse will be lifted? The nose for the sniff. That's my name. Great wizard, because of the greatness. Hmm, I think we have to go to the king now so he can show me the door. I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be here. I'll be there. Go now. I wish he was wearing the, the wizard hat. Hmm. 
No. Uh, what? Yes. Everything is fine. It feels like heaven. What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. That's not Mr. Midnight, that's... He's right there. Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you. I'm not. Let Mr. Midnight go now. We kill the traitors. Because that's what he is, friend. Don't you see? Mr. Kitty. My kitty is not a traitor. He promised me to be by my side. He promised. As your... As your mommy and daddy did. Who promised to take care of you? Wake up, Fran. You are surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friends alone. Leave my brain alone! Never! Never! <laughs> uh, I'm the only one you have, Fran. I'm the one who's always by your side. Now let's get rid of this traitor, eh? What do you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. Ah, no, Mr. Kitty, no. No, that's not okay. That's not kosher at all. Go away, it wasn't me. Fran, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The, do the doctors were right. But you're not crazy. I'm, I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones and you became human again. Kitty is a traitor. He couldn't have just destroyed that piano, but he didn't. He could have. Kitty is a traitor. That is a very great indeed. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear, and I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't, I know that, because you love me. Yes, Kitty, I do love you very much. Don't let the cat be hurt in this game, I swear to God. I swear to God I'm going to uninstall this game like... Like that, if they hurt the cat, I'm gonna uninstall this game and remove it from my Steam library. Fran, remember what I told you. If you love, you are alive. And that is the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. Now let's go and open the gate so you can go home. Yes, let's do it. He has paws. He sure does. Kitty has paws. You know it. It is, but you know what? It was fun here too. Quite an adventure. We'll never forget it, but now we have to leave. Aunt Grace is waiting for us. So, sorry, what are we doing? Where was I supposed to meet the dude? Sorry, I was like not paying attention. Approach the throne room, follow the king left twice, then click on the magical lock. Okay. Here we are. But where is the door? Oh, right, I have to make it visible. Are you sure you want to go back? I'm sure, sir. Alright, here we go. The human must leave. Open the secret door into her reality. Let the human return home. What do you think, guys? Do you think he would leave? Would you Would you leave this place to go home? Zr the king, good day to you. I brought the stones so this lovely creature can go home. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It will be strange to be far away from you all. Then don't leave. I can make you a place to stay, a very magical place. Wizard, she has to leave. I received a message from one of the Valakas, and she is not ready. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, wizard, place the stones. We have no time to lose. Ready for what? You know, what the Valakas told you about facing your truth? Yes, I think I remember. 
I won't leave that place for the sad and lonely reality. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones create the lock that only the human can break. Now, this place is cool compared to IRL. Time for Fran to be the key. You're the only one who can open this now. Alright, let's see. Puzzle time! Oh, I see. I would want to stay, but leave for my family and life here. I smell victory again. You did it, Fran. You can go home now. Yeah, I think I'm the same way. It'd be really cool to stick around, but probably come back. We're, we humans are kind of boring that way, aren't we? I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. Leave the knife. Oh, special girl, why don't you leave that knife with us? You don't need it anymore. Well, I don't know. There's probably a few puzzles left in this game for me to solve. Qu quotation marks around that. Solve. solve. Give us the knife. We want it to remember you by. By your threatening looks. I almost forgot. Palantris gave me this for you. Oh. Thank you for that Da Vinci puzzle box. Oh, thank you. Tell Palantris that I wish I could help him with his wounds. I gave my aid patches to a girl in the hospital, but anyway. I'll tell him, and don't worry, Palantris is better now. Before you go, you must know. You re before you return to reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are a kind of an invisible passage between our realities. You may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. Just run, they are quite slow. And you were telling me this now, huh? Sounds very scary. Don't worry, you'll do fine. I hope so. Well, Mr. Midnight, say goodbye. Let's go now. Goodbye, gentlemen. I had a great time. I like you very much. Goodbye. The one ant, but she can't stay with her. Fran has no one left, really. Yeah, that's true. There's really not much point for Fran to go home. She even has her cat. Her best friend. Like, that's kind of the... That's good end right there. Oh no! Oh, I see. We're we're we we an action game now. Oh, cool. Just jump right the just jump right into the hole. This game's got kind of a Moomin vibe sometimes. You guys excited for the Moomin video game? Official Moomin video game? You guys are ready for that, right? Snuffkin and Moomin? You guys know what I'm talking about, right? I'm not just a talking pumpkin. I'm not just... I'm not just pumpkin nonsense. Yeah, we get to use the knife on scary creatures. My imaginary friend. Moomin Riders? No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, good, our pills. We found them. Isn't that the, like the rudest awakening ever? You come back from like a, a fantasy realm and the first thing you find is your mental pills. The one we tried to cross before we fell into Ethersta. I remember. Great, let's keep on going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. These are my pills. Why are, where are they going? Oh, we don't even get our cool pills back. We have to chase them down. Delicious berries. <laughs> also, Moomin game, hell yes. 
This place is still not good for Fran because these creatures are still haunting her. Are they? I, oh, that tree looked like the one from Adventure Time. I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad friend, bad. Knife time, knife time. It's amazing how often that knife really is the solution to a lot of puzzles. Oh, spooky, scary. You're already here. Well, I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. And as I see it, you are not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, your faithful friend. Itward. Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I am the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you get Mr. Midnight back, you see. Really, huh? I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me. You see, but that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. <laughs> you know, sick burn from Skelly Lad. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear friend, the long man with the top hat? I always came by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. I came to you after you imagined me. But I'm not imaginary, you see, I'm part of your reality. Do they imagine you? You look quite familiar, yes, I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you are able to imagine me because I already existed. Anyway, we don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to talk to you about timeshare condos. You should buy into one, Fran. They're, they're, they're almost gone. You could buy one right now. Buy a timeshare condo. You could be making thousands. Uh, take me home. I can't let you do that. I know. I don't know you. I don't know you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. <laughs> All right, you seem nice. <laughs> what do you mean you seem nice? What kind of compelling evidence that was that? I'm actually a good guy. Oh, okay, sure. No, I believe you. I'll go with you, but I don't trust you yet. That's fine. Come now. Come on now. I have something to show you. Let me stumble out of these bushes. I'm quite a nice guy, you see. Look at my jagged teeth. They are the jagged teeth of a nice person. Let me smell you, Fran. Oh, is this a time machine? Behold, the Itward flying machine. What do you think? I love it. It has many buttons to push. Yes, with this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. We'll fly as soon as I fix the details. Besides, it's not 2.35 yet. That sounds great, but what is it about 2.35, sir? I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower, and that gives us a chance to enter the ultra-reality. Inside the ultra-reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you are part of the third reality. Do you understand? Uh, I do understand. Really? You do? I don't think you do, Fran. It sounds insane. <laughs> But sir, should I just wait until you are done fixing the machine? Wait? Of course not. You can help us by getting water and fire berries. All right. It's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great! Here is my amazing handmade bu bucket for the water. I made it myself. Ooh, fancy. Ah, and the fire berries. You'll realize which berries to pick up because of the fire. All right, but sir, can I just ask why do you need the berries in the water? Well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is to get rid of the dirt. The kalamas. Kamalas. Oh, kamalas, I see. Yeah, I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know, but we will do know what they don't like. Water. Yes? Oh, darling, I almost forgot. You're a medicine. You need it. Say, some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Here. Invisible to my eyes? Hmm, I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me at first. Oh yes, about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. It's okay, sir. I defeated the trap like in one second. Anyway, I'll get the fire berries in the water. I'll be right back. Great. I'll be preparing the machine. Alright, well, match is time. 
Do, 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 do. With berries. What do you mean? What do you mean? Okay, well, what do we do with this? Wonder why Palantras gave me this. I can't open it. Okay. Mmm, delicious berries. Do, 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 do. Hell. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry. But you seem to be all rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you are misunderstanding the situation. Misunderstanding? Why do you say that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose? But I am not a moose. I'm a deedle worm. A deedle worm. Deadly worm? Oh my god. A deadly worm? No, no, not a deadly worm, a deedly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. I just give back this to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need anymore. But I only see a talking moose, where are you? Oh, down here, creature, can't you see me? Oh, my name is Fran, you were so tiny, hello. Hello, Fran. Can I ask, why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally only scavengers would touch dead animals, are you one? Fireberries above me. Yeah, I see them. I seen them. Of course not. I was trying to see if I could climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it's possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. And I see the fire, but I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir. Creepy. Can't take the fireberries. They are on fire. Okay. Oh, look at that. A little friend in the background. So much hair and so shiny. Hello. Hello, friend. Are you those tiny insects that get stuck on tree because of curiosity? We usually get stuck, yes. How do you know this? You're not one of us. I met your kind. I helped them get free from curiosity. That is very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to expect unexpected situations. Are you stuck? Not at all. We're just trying to make our hair the longest hair ever. Wow, that sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. Things not working makes me angry. I hate the water and I hate the fairy berries. So much hair and so shiny. I get mad when things are weird, and they're weird all of the time. If they are on fire forever, then it really is legit source of energy. <laughs> Ooh, I look completely deformed. Am I nutritious? I bet I am. Tasty fresh flesh? Mmm. You are the Kamalas, aren't you? Um, I don't know where to get the water. Let's see, let's see if I have anything I can pick up the berries for, with. Uh, knife. But they are on fire. What are you, what are you talking about? Just cut them out. Just cut them down. It could work if I had water inside the bucket. Well, where do we get water? Oh, I can pick them up now. They're firmly... What do you mean? Oh, knife? Oh, there we go. They're not on fire now. Alright. We did it. We did it, lads. Ugh. Are they on fire now? They're not on fire fire anymore, okay. Uh, 
No, I had a feeling. Maybe we fell upside down. Can't reach the water. So I'm guessing we need the hair. Okay, um... Maybe we need to go to the where the hair starts. Rope equals hair equals knife party. I agree. It won't do. Just why not? Um, hmm. Tie hair to bucket? Oh, that's an interesting idea. Would you allow me to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why? That sounds insane. Not insane at all. I need water from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. Well, I'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Thank you. You're very nice. There you go. Good idea. We all wish to belong, but does home belong somewhere? I don't understand. It was a rhetorical question, I just wanted to say that. You're on your own home. You are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. That sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Goodbye. All right, so we're good. So where here's the bucket full of water. I got help from the shiny insects. You mean the luciferns? They are nice, but uh, nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you ever see them in the fifth reality. They can burn you. Wow, burn you? Well, I haven't been into the uh, fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. They're reasonable there. May be the worst you'll ever experience. Forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, friend. I brought the fireberries, but they are not on fire anymore. Magnificent. They'll do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. It's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. Yo... You had to duck real low to get in that door. Even Fran would have had to duck a little bit. It's 236. We have a great responsibility of reaching the target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited? Maybe I would be excited if I could understand more about the realities. You'll soon understand. The answers are not easy to recognize. Sounds strange. Time goes as it has to, in order for you to be alive. If it all happened now, you'd probably explode. Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say... Through time, you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answers will come when you find them, not when others tell you how or where to find them. I disagree. The guide is telling me the answers exactly when I want them. I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my curiosity, uh, curiousness. That's the best thing you can do for yourself. Be curious and you'll always be amazed. 
But now, friend, we have to get things done. Talking won't take you home. What things, sir? The machine needs some maintenance, and I think you would do incredible work. Here are the fireberries and the water you gathered before. You'll need them to get the water pump working again, and the fuel mixed. You'll find all information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. I'll be a busy fixing the automatic driver. If you have something to ask, I'll be here. Never done this before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun. Alright. Goodbye. Maybe I should push the button? Alright. Yo, it's Mr. Midnight Robot. So that means uh, the skelly lad led us here? That's a huge spinning top. Compass goes in circles. Okay, we gotta we gotta make some stuff. Um AFM missing. Uh, AFM AFM is missing, so we need to make AFM. Uh, maybe Fran never left the Institute, and this is her journey of healing. First escape reality, fix yourself, then return. I'm willing to believe that. I think we're missing some stuff. Reality view, ultra re reality view. So we've been exploring the ultra reality. And this is how we make the stuff we need. Micronutrients in fireberries will supercharge an engine and ensure it lasts forever. Fireberries, Afuga Merzenis, AFM. Oh, I see. We need to make AFM. It's red if it's not working. Do we need to pour the water in here, maybe? Hose seems to be damaged. Um, we need to fix the hose with some tape, maybe? Uh, we can always pills it up. Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick-tock, tick-tock. Forgot to understand you. All right, we got another piece, but I don't think that, I think that was just on the table. More hoses still. Oh wow, he looks different in ultra reality. We need the tape. Hammer. What about this stuff? Shoes. Weird. The twins are here. Wonder what it's for. Are you, are you here to kill Itward? I'm very sorry for what I did. I hope you can forgive me.
Leads to a door, but it's closed. Looks like a mathematical problem. Key. Key go in here. Matches on the burner, you're right. In a world made of darkness and light, two little sisters tried to steal each other's charm, but none of the sides could decide if what they want, what they were was just right. Luigi is cooler than Mario and he got a better princess by far. That's not a hot take, everyone thinks it. This was because they were both mad. Insane little girls. Hey, I wonder if Fran is also a twin. Inside of their minds, it were the creature of the night. He came always around in dreams of reality, teaching the girls the splendor of duality. But they couldn't understand. Hintward was a friend. Hintward was the link between darkness and light. He was gray. But Clara and Mia one day decided to get rid of Hintward once and for all. Die, creature of the night. Die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone. Sisters kept complaining about each other. It's all your fault, Clara. It's all your far fault, Mia. And then Edward came to visit for the last time. I, I, I failed at my hot take. And he said, you are both trapped. In the world of disconnections. But I'll give you a chance. The world has been mean to you. They, stewed you. they sewed your bodies together to prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have. And just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. The clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing. Noelle's magic door is unlocked. The end. 2.35, huh? Here's what I think. I kind of think that this is a complete guess. Not sure, you know, obviously it's all um, theory crafting. Um, I think that Fran has a twin. And I think that the twin went insane. And started killing people. Like, he, she was crazy and she killed people, okay? Um, and I think that, you know, they she got kind of, maybe she she's still missing. She's not, like, she's still out there somewhere. But I think Fran herself wasn't actually insane. But because she was a twin, uh, maybe people assumed that she was. And so, to be very sure that she wouldn't, you know, harm people, they, uh, they locked her up and, like, constantly compared her to her sister. And, and it was very traumatic for Fran. But Fran was actually a nice person. Didn't, didn't kill people, wasn't crazy. And, um... But, like, still, it's very traumatic for her. She got locked up and, um, you know, she's been constantly compared to her sister. And uh, this is just kind of her working through her problems. Maybe her aunt uh, was someone who believed that she was actually a good person. Completely, you know, just, just spitball in here.
Winner. Is that it? Is it? Is it just a mini game? I thought maybe there was something else. All right, so I think we can do this now. I'm gonna take a picture of this and put it on my second monitor, so I don't have to, you know, fritz with this. Uh, blue is here. No. Blue goes on the A18. Pink goes on this one. And we need this one that is going to attach to this. So this is correct. This is correct. Um matches correct and where did the berries go you think Oh, I see. I have to put these in the in the correct one. Okay. Um Oh, no. Wait. Sorry. They're they're marked. I don't have AFM. A18 goes there. This is nothing. 2PF goes here. Two PF goes there. A eighteen goes there. Um R fifteen goes here. N one sixty six goes there. So I just need AFM. So where does one get AFM? Ah. Um. Is this ready to go? So this has to be on the right. I think it is done. Super Chemistry Master Franbo. Look at the blue red handles. AFM is what you're making of the bears. Yeah. There's a bit of a time um, there's, there's a time gap between when I say something and... Oh yeah, we gotta fix this up. Pump is now filled with water. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with this. Oh, here, here we go. Um, all right, let's just take a picture. It's just easier for me. Oh, we need a match. There's no gas coming from the pipe.
There you go. You may have to set playback speed to 1.25 from time to time because micro stutters add up. Oh my god. Hold on a second, something weird is just happening on Discord. Um... I think that someone on a... on a Discord spammed everyone or the discord got hacked and like mentioned everyone in every single channel so suddenly i just had like 16 notifications in my inbox oh yeah it was it was a bot weird okay all right done sorry sorry for the interruption everyone Man, I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need help? I think I managed myself quite well, too. I did all you asked of me. Very well, Fran. Everything seems to be working perfectly. Everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now? I wanted to ask you if you are afraid of rabbits. What a strange question. There's a little rabbit in one of the rooms, and I'm, I'm deeply afraid of it. Would you help me get rid of it? Rabbit? I guess it depends on the rabbit, sir. I think the truth is that just that I have fifth world internet speeds, man. Being so far away from big ping is like 700 milliseconds. Is it a chocolate rabbit or one of those horns and killer eyes? One with horns and killer eyes? You'll have to see it for yourself. It has a pink nose and blue boots. I'm just... It's just sitting there. No blinking, no movement. It's staring all the time. It does sound very scary, sir, but uh, show it to me. Otherwise, I'll never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me now. Um, lads and, and, and lassies, um, we're, we're coming up to the end of the stream here, so if there's a, um, convenient time to stop, I will. There, see? It's just sitting there. Isn't that a strange behavior? It's just a toy. Would you please try to make contact with it? I don't dare touch it. Alright, sir, I'll take the rabbit and show you there's nothing to be afraid of. Uh, I haven't dropped any frames. I have, I have zero dropped frames, so I'm not sure. It's, if there's a problem, I don't know if it's on my end. You're right, friend. There is nothing to be afraid of. What? No, the cat. I swear to God. Tasty carrot. It's giving me the lang the, the the numbers of fairy tale world. We got a wrench. Hello, are you Itward's other head? I like the hat. Do 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 Depends on my Wi-Fi. Found a battery. Won't turn on. Wrench. Wrench time. Lefty Lucy. Oh, battery.
I now know how to watch stream real time. Are you? No. I've seen these on movies. The thief always knows what to do. I didn't hear anything. Also, how a nine-year-old nine-year-old or something knows how to pick safe locks. Make music with the wind. Getting uh, getting ready to look it up soon. I'm dropping out of reality myself a little bit, snoozing. This is connected to something. Teapot water thrower. This is a massive and dangerous weapon. in the inventory well we have a carrot maybe I have to grow the carrot or something oh I didn't I didn't look here mechanical rabbit it's not very cute why did you scare it word anyway you were very cute Lovely plants. Are we watering the plants? You just got water for the water container though. This is a tree. Sure is. Oh, 
Oh, this is the combination. Okay, I get it. I get it. So, one, two, three. One, two, three, four. Sorry I keep screen capping, but it's actually very helpful and it speeds things along for me a little bit. So, uh, in my helpful little book, guys, remember my helpful little book? It's being very helpful right now. So it's going to be 8 to the right. And then, um, oh, I can't see it because there's a rabbit in the way. We need to give this the carrot to them. There we go. Then it's going to be five to the right. Uh, then it's this one. Uh, eight to the left. Do I have to unsub and resub on the first? I don't think so. Do you know how I can get my coffee debit order to come off on another date? I guess so, yeah, you'd, you'd have to unsub and then resub on the day you want it to, to resub on. Four. I guess it already had the number on it. Like, it still has the number on it, but for some reason when I click on it, it doesn't? I don't know. Nine. Okay, so we, we got it. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, there we go. Oh, surprise, friend. Happy birthday. That was actually spooky. Oh, a birthday party. Whoa, I thought you wanted to kill Mr. Midnight. You lied to me. I lied to you in order to keep your attention in another direction. Sir, you are, dre you are dealing with a person with trauma. That was not okay. I'm very sorry I had to fool you, my friend. We wanted to surprise you, my dear friend. Come and let eat cake. All right, thank you, kitty. You really surprised me. Thank you, Edward. The cake is made of all ingredients you like. Mr. Midnight told me which ones. And we have something very special for you, from all members of the ship. That means all of us, naturally born or handsome beings. Here you go. I hope you find it educational. Looks like a cat. I love the wrapping. Can I open it now, please? Yes, go ahead, open it. It's Mr. Midnight. Cat doll, thank you so much, I love it. It's beautiful. It may give your eyes a new perception, you know, like the ultra reality. Is that what happens when I take the red pills, sir? Is the ultra reality what I see? Well, it depends. Would you like some explanations? Sure. What you've seen is a mixture of different realities. And the re ultra reality is like an invisible room where everything exists at the same time. For example, at this exact coordinate of time and space, we're having a birthday party. Um, but in the ultra reality, other things are happening all of the time. Slower, faster, or just invisible to the human eye. It's because of time humans can define past, present, and future. Defining things encapsulates reality. It gives humans a chance to understand their environment. You have a different perception of the environment. It's not linked to definitions. Do you understand what I say? I'm not sure, sir. I think maybe. I feel a bit dizzy. That may be the ship going up and down. Blow on the candles now, sir. Dear, we are about to reach our destination. You mean we're about to get home? Did you hear that, kitty? We are about to arrive. Wow, how exciting. All right, here I go. Oh no, no, no. 
Mr. Midnight, are you alright? Oh, but I hope the ship won't break. It sounds dangerous. Ryan, you have to help. I ha have to drive the machine again. The automatic driver was destroyed by the Kamalas. There's one left alive. You have to get rid of it. Find it fast. How do I do that, sir? Water. That cleans the dirt. Hurry up now. Remember, it may be hiding from your eyes. We have to find the Kamala. I hope that the water destroys it. Let's go. There it is. Don't run away, where are you going? There we go. I think I finally got rid of the Camilla. I'm the best. Should go back to Itward. Edward, sir, we did it. The Camilla is gone. It's gone, yes, but it's too late, dear. I can't take you home. We are going down. No, please don't tell me this. It's not fair. Not fair. I will always take care of you, my dear. Sad. Sad facing. All right. And the ship was going down until it crashed. Everything was destroyed. That teapot thing actually had a reasonable explanation. The end. What? But that is a very sad ending, Edward. Tell me another story, please. Alright, this is the story of Fran, Bo, and me. When she promised never to forget me or about the magic of everything. This is this the ending? I promise it word, I'll never forget you. Good, now it's time to sleep. I like the cat. Expect me in your dreams, my friend. Okay, so this is the next part. Um, we're going to call it here. We're going to call stream here. Edward.